Pancreatitis is inflammation of the pancreas, which is an organ that sits in the middle of your abdomen and helps maintain your insulin level. Pancreatitis can happen in the acute phase or the chronic phase. Acute pancreatitis is where people develop severe abdominal pain that often starts in the middle here and radiates back to their back, can be accompanied by nausea and vomiting and even fever. The top two causes of pancreatitis are actually excessive alcohol use and gallbladder disease or gallstones. Usually acute pancreatitis is treated in the hospital with bowel rest where we let people not eat for a couple of days and some pain medicine. Most patients, greater than 80%, will actually recover spontaneously and not have any problems. However, if patients continue to drink alcohol excessively, they may have chronic pancreatitis, which is a chronic inflammation of the pancreas. At that stage, doctors may actually want to replace some pancreatic enzymes to help patients digest food a little bit better, and patients may actually require long-term pain control. The best thing to do, and you'll find this out from your mother's doctor, is to follow a low-fat diet, um, use pain medicines as needed, and try to refrain from drinking any alcohol in the future.